The lifespan of dragons in the world of A Song of Ice and Fire, which Game of Thrones is based on, is quite impressive, to put it mildly. There's no definitive expiration date listed for these magnificent creatures in George R. R. Martin's texts, likely because they're quite rare and let's face it, dragon healthcare records from medieval times are a bit lacking. But what we do know from the lore is that dragons in Westeros can live for a very long time, potentially hundreds of years. The most straightforward example of draconian longevity comes from Balerion the Black Dread, Aegon the Conqueror's legendary beast. That massive, fire-breathing sky terror was reputed to have lived for about 200 years. That's a bit hard to wrap your head around, right? Imagine having a pet that could stick around for a couple of centuries, witnessing the rise and fall of empires. Well, if you forget about the whole burning cities to the ground part. But like all living creatures, dragons do eventually die, whether from the passage of age, sickness, or more likely, the pointy end of human intervention. I mean, a dragon doesn't just keel over while chasing its tail. They typically go out in a blaze of, well, glory might be too romanticized for a dragon's last stand. So, if you're a dragon rider or just an enthusiast within the realms of Westeros or Essos, take comfort in knowing your fire-breathing friend could outlast several generations of your family. That is, if they aren't skewered by a lance or taken down by another dragon. As an aside, while dragons are not subject of my daily musings here in Portland, where the only dragons you're likely to encounter are part of a vibrant tattoo or coiled in an elaborate Chinese New Year parade, it's fun to speculate on the lifespans of mythical creatures within the rich tapestries of fantasy literature. Remember, fantasy mirrors life in that it's unpredictable and full of unscripted moments. So, the life expectancy of a dragon is really up to the whims of the writer who created them, or the archer aiming for their underbelly.